Hey everyone, happy Sunday, and thanks for coming to watch our video. Um, as we know, this is not a traditional time, and this is not a traditional shower. We want to thank you all from the bottom of our hearts for making us feel so special, loved, and spoiled during this time, even though we can't all gather. So I hope you guys enjoy. We're gonna do a little bit of a nursery tour and I'm gonna go through all of the wonderful gifts that we received. Um, if you don't see your gift in here, I think it is due to the fact that the post office is very delayed right now. Um, so we will receive it and we still appreciate it so much. So love you all and enjoy. When I walk into this room, I just see <laughs> so many beautiful things and so much love for a little guy that isn't even here yet um, so i'm just going to give you an overview and then i'm going to go through some of the amazing stuff that we received so this room prior to the baby was actually like a guest room slash um, storage room <laughs> it didn't have a lot of love and care or attention to details so chad did an amazing job at kind of transforming it into a space where um, it now is a functional nursery. Um, my favorite part of the nursery for sure is the um, wall. This is like a herringbone stencil that Chad did um, by hand. <laughs> and um, God bless him <laughs> for doing it. Um, but I love how it turned out. Um, we're gonna put his name sign above the crib if we can ever fully decide on the name we're kind of down to like two or three but it kind of changes daily um, we had a set name and then chad kind of pulled out the backup goalie so we'll see we'll we'll uh we'll have to figure that out um i will say though as of right now no one has guessed the name um which is kind of surprising to me but um if you still want to keep guessing until he's born um, we love to hear your guys' name ideas. So that is the wall there and that is the um, story behind how it is empty. So from the minute that this Facebook group was created for us to do guessing um, and kind of celebrate the little guy in the way that we could, um, we started receiving packages within days um, of just like beautiful stuff for him. Um, so again, thank you. I'm gonna go through as much of it as I can that I have. Um, I know the post office is delayed. They're doing more um, essential deliveries prior to um, ones that aren't like a food um, or things like that, um, that aren't classified as essential. So um, if your things aren't here, I know we will receive them um, and know we appreciate them so much. Um, but I'll go through what we have here. Um, and yeah, I'll show you guys all the stuff that we got. Also, I'm going to address the elephant in the room, and no, I am not the elephant. The elephant in the room is my COVID-19 quarantine hair that I haven't been able to get done. Uh, my roots have basically gone all the way down to the back of my head, and I have about this much blonde left. So, I hope that you really love, love whatever this is. <laughs> so, I'm going to go through some of this awesome stuff so we got um two of these which i'm so excited about they are by a company called moody park and they're basically like a three-in-one type of item so they're used as a car seat cover as well as a nursing cover as well as for like a grocery cart you can use to kind of cover up the metal part when the baby gets older. So we received um, two of those, which are amazing. I'm so excited to use those. Will come in handy when we are able to kind of get out and about and it'll be awesome for covering up his car seat when we go to doctor's appointments. Um, Burt's Bees have been like one of my favorite brands for a really long time. So I was super excited to see that um, they have so many awesome products for babies. So we received um, these Burt's Bees. Um, burping cloths they're so soft and so um, such nice quality so we have a bunch of those for him then we also got all this fabulous stuff for his bath so we've got ointments diaper rash ointment um, baby oil and then as well as shampoos um, lotions these are all um, like little face cloths and stuff that we received so that will be awesome for his baths we also received this little guy, which is so cute. Um, this is like a like a teether for their gums. I just love that it's a banana. I don't know why I love that so much. Um, and then we also received bed bed sheets here. 
um, his whole bath set, which is awesome. So we received um, this to cover up the spout, um, a bath mat. Um, this thing holds all of the bath toys. We actually already put all those toys in. This was in our bathroom, but now we're renovating the bathroom. So it's in here so you guys can take a look at it. Also received beautiful swaddles for him for when he's first born. Spoons for when he goes to start eating. Bowls for when he starts eating. The cutest little toys to just kind of um, occupy him and put on his little gym as well as his car seat. Some of the cutest clothes. So we got so many cute um, little outfits. Um, this one says little man, so cute. Um, some root stuff. Love the hood on this one here. It's got little bear ears as well as this little hat here. Bath towels for him for when he needs to take a bath. <laughs> when he needs to take a bath. When we give him a bath. <laughs> and then as well as so much stuff down here. So we've received some wipes as gifts. We've received some diapers as gifts. Um, car mirror. Um, for the car, which is perfect. Um, over here, um, we also received this beautiful diaper bag, um, which I've actually already filled. One thing about this like whole virus thing is it's given me a lot of time on my hands. We also got this for um, drying like the soothers and the bottles. Um, so thank you so much. As well as this changing pad and cover. And we received another cover as well. It's just hidden underneath all of this stuff. So thank you so very much. With having so much time on my hands, like he has his diaper bag packed for his first outing, his hospital bag is packed. Um, yeah, it's been really great actually in the sense that it's given us a lot of time to slow down um, and just kind of relax and get a lot of stuff done prior to his arrival. Um, so that's been really great. So we also received lots of books as well from people um, we received this for his car seat, which is amazing. We also received this for his car seat that also can go on um, a carrier. It kind of clips on to be as like a shield or a cover. So it can go on the stroller car seat and on the baby carrier. So I'm really excited to use that. Um, we're big, we're big like walkers and hikers. So I think that will be really, really handy. Um, so thank you so much. We received his car seat and his stroller which is amazing, so thank you. Um, a bumbo chair for him. I tried to get everything very gender neutral so that if we have like other children, it's easy to just like hand it down. Um, so we got the bumbo here, the car seat, which this also came with a stroller as well. So I'm so excited for that. Um, I love walking. So I think that will be really a nice activity to do with him once he's born. Um, we also received our rocking chair, which I absolutely love. I cannot wait to rock him in this. Um, it's just, it honestly made it really real when we built the rocking chair just because it's a place where we're going to spend lots of time with him. We received our video monitors as well. Um, so we just have them kind of set up there. We also got our beautiful crib and mattress. So thank you so, so much. Also, this cute little newborn swaddle. I just have it here, washed it, so it's ready for him. I don't think he'll sleep in his crib, but it's just here. <laughs> but there's um, the swaddle there. We also received um, our nursing pillow, so thank you so much. And then we also received another swaddle in the size up, which is perfect. And then this bassinet that will be in our bedroom um, for when he's first born. A play mat, which I absolutely love. Thank you so much. We're going to actually have a gym that it goes above that. Um, I made the little pieces for the gym and Chad's gonna build the structure. Also received this beautiful play mat um, for him to just kind of do tummy time and hang out on. We just put those up on the wall actually not too long ago. He also has lots of books and toys in here that he has been gifted as well. And then this is like a hand-me-down from when um, Chad and I were both obsessed with Poe growing up <laughs> and we both actually have a picture of us little with Poe so um, we thought that this would be really cute to pass down to him and then there's just lots of books and stuff in here um, for him. We're gonna be hanging some bookshelves but we just didn't know exactly what we wanted to do yet. 
if you know who this is, yep, childhood right there. I also want to mention there was lots of people who um, didn't necessarily want to online shop and wanted to send money instead or gift cards um, for us to kind of buy whatever he needs. So thank you so much from the bottom of our heart for those people who did that. Um, we appreciate it so much and it will be so nice um, to have that for when he comes and we can pick up the remaining stuff on the registry that he needs or anything that he might need. Um, when he arrives. So thank you so very much for that as well. I also wanted to mention the amount of clothing that we received, both as gifts, hand-me-downs. Um, people reached out that were either family or friends that have recently had children that had stuff that they no longer needed or were passing along. So his dressers and his closet are jam-packed with clothes that have either been purchased or passed down so we really do appreciate that so here's just a little sneak peek of his closet there's also um, diaper genie refills and stuff that we received as gifts um, up there in those baskets so thank you so much um, his clothes go all the way back to there and then he has some extra onesies over there and then just to give you an idea his drawers are pretty jam-packed as i said um, with a mix of just purchased stuff and things that were passed along so thank you so very much um, for everyone who either reached out and gave us stuff that they no longer needed or purchased clothes for him. Um, we really do appreciate it. When I first found out that I was pregnant, I kind of had this like obsession with buying diapers on sale and getting really good deals on Amazon on diapers. So I feel like it wouldn't be right of me if I didn't show you my stash of diapers. So his change table is all packed with those white bins of diapers. And then we also have this stash. So I just wanna end off this video by saying thank you so much and we love you all so very much. Um, we are so excited to meet him. We are so excited to show him off. So I will make sure that I keep updating this page. Please keep your name guesses coming, your weight guesses coming, and your due date guesses coming. Um, it's so fun to, to log into Facebook and see um, what you guys, what you guys are thinking in regards to the day that he's arriving, how much he's gonna weigh, and what we're gonna name him. Um, so excited to announce also who won the belly challenge. I will be posting a picture with the actual measurement as well as who won. I'm very impressed with how close some of the guesses were um, and it was so much fun to do. So love you all so much and have a wonderful rest of your day. Um, we can't wait and I know that you guys are all very excited to meet him.